Hello, this is Chris Rowlands with BestWindowsMobileApps.com bringing you an exclusive review of iCopy. This isn't even on Windows Mobile Marketplace as of yet, but it will be shortly. So let's open it up. This is a program for taking a variety of pictures and then saving them all into a PDF file together, which is incredibly handy for when you want to send a whole bunch of photos to someone else over the internet. It, it's good for keeping them in one place. So you can take photos by either clicking on the icon there, which says in small writing, take a photo, or the soft key down here. This takes you straight into your camera app. For this review, I have three little transformers here. So I shall take a picture of this one, Optimus Prime. Um, there you go, click back, and it shows you a little preview of your image there. You can use this button to delete them if you don't like it, but I don't want to. Now, if you see, it has cut off a little bit at the top and bottom, but um, a little bit more on that in the moment. Let's take another couple of photos. So, over here we have the original Bumblebee. Lovely. And then a third picture. which is Warpath. The names of these Transformers is not at all important for this review, but no harm. Um, when you have more than one image, you can use these buttons to scroll between them. Um, again, they have cut off some of the picture. Now, going to Menu, you can add existing images um, and send the PDFs, but I found that those tend to make the application crash. I don't know if that's just this device or if that's a problem with the app, but I'm hoping they sort that out before it actually ends up on Marketplace. So you can also start over, which erases all the pictures, or save it, which is what I want. Now I'm going to call it Transformers and oh, I'm going to save it to storage card, save it, done. Um, saving is very quick. The app itself, I'm very impressed with the speed. It goes quite quickly. So I've saved that. So if I exit, it asks you, do you want to take the, if you want to save the photos that you've taken. Um, so I'm going to click yes. So it keeps them. So when I scroll across to pictures, it should have my three photos that I've taken. Note without having anything cut off. And then when I go across to my Documents tab, which is just a feature of HTC Sense, not something that comes with iCopy, I can open up my PDF, fit to screen, and there you have it. Three different pictures saved into one PDF, but they have had a bit of cropping done to them, which, as you can see, has chopped off some of their heads. Um, this is because they try to make it fit into a square. I don't quite know why they've done this, but, well, um, that's something else I hope they can change. So, thank you. This is Chris Rowlands. Thanks for watching. Bye.